It's 2023 now, which means that as the 3DS turns 12 years old, Nintendo has decided that it's time to cut ties with its beloved child and leave it to rot in the dust and turn off its internet forever and make sure that no one can ever love it ever again. Let's have a moment of silence, shall we? That's enough. Anyway, the 3DS was a major success for Nintendo. It sold over 80 million units. That means that there's over 80 million of these bad boys out there in the wild. And even though the Nintendo Switch basically killed the 3DS on purpose, I can't help but wonder if there are still people playing this little thing in the year 2023. And I figure there's a really good way of finding out. I'm going to take this with me on vacation and see if anyone passes me who can give me street pass content. So I actually have 12 3DS systems. Yes, 12. Uh, I, I can't stop collecting them and I refuse to. It's not a problem until I admit it, but I'm picking this one specifically to bring with me for one particular reason. Uh, this is a very special 3DS, not just because I've added this vinyl sticker of Helioptile on the front, but also because this has been modified with a capture card. So I have plugged my 3DS into my computer and as you can see, I can now move all around on the home menu and show you guys everything to see here. And uh, let's hop over to the street pass. Where is that on this thing? I actually completely forget, <laughs> hang on. Here we go, Street Pass Me Plaza. So let's just plop in there and see what this looks like. So the way Street Pass works is when two 3DSs pass by each other really closely, you're able to sort of exchange a little bit of data with each other. So here we go, the uh, <laughs> the Street Pass that I've got here. I can't remember the last time that I actually opened this up. I've got to make sure that I um, empty it out. But the most important thing that I want to worry about is Puzzle Swap right here. So I've added the bottom screen here so that I can properly show you what my goal is with this video. So as you can see here, I'm in the Puzzle Swap app. And as you can see, I have collected 1,591 pieces out of 1,667. I have met 1,515 people through Street Pass, which I'm almost positive most of those were during my trips to uh, the Pokemon World Championships in 2015 and 2016. Let me go ahead and and go through these few people that I have accumulated in the time that I have, in the time since the last time that I turn on this game. So this is me passing myself on another 3DS. So I'm picking up another piece there. You can see pieces collected just went up to 1592. If you pass by someone who cannot offer you any new pieces, you will see them in your plaza, but they will not be able to give you any new pieces. And you can accumulate up to 10 people before you have to swap out so there you see, no new pieces. So now my plaza is completely empty, which means right now I can pass up to 10 people on my 3DS who also have a 3DS of their own. I have 1,564 pieces. If I can get even six more pieces and get up to an even 1,600 total by the end of this trip, I will consider that a success. So my 3DS is all done, ready to go closed it up and I'm ready to pack this and take this with me on vacation. And through the power of editing, I have arrived in three, two, one. Well, I am now on my vacation. I have my 3DS with me and uh, I gotta find out where I am real quick. So let me find that out. So we just landed in France and as we are now officially on vacation, I'm going to take this opportunity to turn on my 3DS. From here on out, if I street pass anybody, I'll know. Okay, so we just checked into our hotel here at Disney's Newport Bay Club Hotel. We have, at this point, traveled across four trains, a uh, shuttle bus from Disney Village to the hotel, and passed by at least a few thousand people. So, do we have any street passers yet? Why, oh why, does my Switch freeze up when it goes to sleep like that? There we go. It's a 3DS, not a Switch. Why did I say that? Sleep deprived. Sleep deprived. You want to know the full story? Go and check out our second channel, Skull Travels the World. It, it sure looks like I haven't passed anyone new, so day one was a bust. Let's see what happens tomorrow when I go into Disneyland proper.
So if I'm correct, that little light up there should glow green whenever I have street pass somebody. And since it's not glowing green, I am going to assume that I have yet to street pass anybody. Street pass is on. So if we go into the Mi Plaza, have I passed anybody, anybody at all? And the answer is no, I haven't. I must have passed over 10,000 people by now and not a single person had a 3DS. What has happened to the youth of the world? So, end of day two, we just got back from the parks after riding every unique ride at Disneyland Paris and watching the beautiful Christmas themed fireworks and we passed somebody. For the very first time, there's at least one person in France who still uses a 3DS. Let's go ahead and see what they got. Um, okay. So whoever Jean is, you have passed me and let's do some puzzle swap. Let's see if you've got a puzzle piece for me. Uh, Jean Cree from France. No new puzzle pieces. That's okay. We passed someone. We've proven that it can be done. So, one person passed. No new puzzle pieces, but that's okay because tomorrow we're going into Paris, which means we're going to the Louvre. And if any of you know anything about 3DSs, you know what's at the Louvre. Okay, we are at the end of Sunday. We only have one full day left in France tomorrow, and then we fly home. And wouldn't you believe it, guys, somebody street passed me on my 3DS. I am going to wait until we get home to see who I street passed. There is a very real possibility that that's the last street pass I'm gonna get. Maybe we'll pass one or two more people, we'll see. Uh, but regardless, we have at least one to look forward to when we go back to the United States later this week. Well, I had an amazing trip to France and my 3DS came back with me safe and sound. So the all important question, did my street pass produce any new puzzle pieces during this trip? Let's plug it in and find out. Okay, this is Pauline from France. Cuckoo, I, I don't know what that means, but hello Pauline from France. And Lou from Center. We passed two people, everybody. Woohoo! New region, France Center. Okay! That's something. That's something really cool, actually. So let's load up Puzzle Swap and see if we got any new pieces. Also, I forgot to mention this. You can always just buy new pieces using the play coins. You rack those up by just walking around with your 3DS, so. I'll probably be picking up some of those at the end of this as well. So, Pauline, do you have any pieces for me? No, you do not. And finally, Lou, do you have any pieces for me? No, you do not. <laughs> I passed three people during this experiment and not a single one of them had a puzzle piece for me. But again, that's fine because I can just buy a piece. There we go, just hit 1600 pieces. So technically I did hit my goal for this video. I just didn't get the pieces from people that I passed, but I did pass three people during my trip overseas, which is, you know, I'll take it, I'll take it. People do still use the 3DS in the year 2023. So that'll bring this video to an end. Again, if you're interested in watching the entirety of my trip, make sure to subscribe to my second channel, Skull Travels the World. The first two videos are out already and the rest of the trip will be uploaded every single Saturday from here until the trip is over. And then of course I got plenty of other trips that are upcoming. So new videos every Saturday on Skull Travels the World for pretty much the foreseeable future. If you play the 3DS in the year 2023 and if you take it with you, no matter where you go in the world, be sure 
sure to let me know in the comments. I am very interested to hear everyone's stories about where they brought their 3DS. That'll wrap up this video. I'd say that this experiment was a success, if only barely, but hey, 3DS, people still use it 12 years after it released. That does it for now. Thanks everyone for watching and stay tuned for more.